Hey there guys, this is Phone Tech Kid and today I have an awesome review for you guys. So as you can see, this is the Play Store, it says Google Play right there. But it looks a lot different. And guys, this is the new version of the Google Play Store. I'll have the link down below to download it. So let's get into this. Okay, so once you've downloaded it, the file is going to look like this, com.androidvending. You're going to click on that and you're going to click install. It'll take you into settings and you'll have to uh, click allow unknown sources. You're going to click install. It should take a couple of seconds. Let's let it download. And then done. You have it installed and now you only have one Play Store still. So as we're going through here, there we have the Play Store. Let's open it up. As you can see, it kind of has this new hollow white look instead of the hollow dark, which we're used to. So right here we have some categories, apps, movies and TV, books, games, music, and magazines. If we scroll down, we have gangster movies, uh, read-free previews, recommended for you. So they have some songs here and an app, some albums that you could um, look through, reading apps. Just clean up all this stuff, and as you keep scrolling down, personalized apps. I mean, you could go all the way down to free music. We have some new movie releases that you could look through. A lot of cool stuff there. So, first, let's go into apps because that's where we're usually at. And as you can see here, we have a home, and we could scroll through here. There's uh, health and fitness. And I think if you click on the category, it'll take you to all the apps that are in that group. Uh, we have apps for reading, play picks, all these good stuff um, recommended for you. We click in here and see all the apps that are recommended for us, or especially for me. You can look through that, which is pretty cool. As you can see, first of all, the store looks a lot more colorful. So right here we're at our home. This is where the home is, and if we swipe over, here we have the top paid apps, and it looks in a lot better layout than the stock version you're used to. As you can see, there's only one line now here. We could look through here. If we swipe again, we have our top free apps all in order here. We have our top grossing apps, top new paid apps. And as you can see, it's really, really fast and fluid. If we go back here, we have games, a separate category for games now, apparently. We have top paid right here. We go through here. And I like how they split it up to have a games and app section be different. Same goes for movies and TV. If we open up in here, we have our home, like new movie releases, top selling movies, new movies. And it looks really nice if you look at it. TV shows is separated. Uh, music is the same thing. We have our home. Then we have our top albums and our top songs. And as you can see, each category is kind of themed to their color. So books is themed nice blue. We could look through here, top selling, all this good stuff. It looks amazingly nice. Actually, a lot better than before. If we hop into settings, we could see we could allow notifications, auto add widgets, auto update apps. We could clear search history. And now we can actually um, choose if you want the password so uh, if you want the password popping up when you're installing an app you can enable it or disable it here I'm gonna disable it and see you could type in your password right there that'll be it um, if we exit out and let's go download an app let's see how it looks when you're downloading it let's go to top free um, let's download Pandora as you can see when we click on the description of the app looks pretty similar we have our comments our rating here the screenshots we could look through and you could uh, give it a rate yourself. We're going to click install. It asks you the app permissions. You want to accept that. And then you, it'll ask you now if you want to update automatically. We'll click OK. And as you can see, it actually took away that uh, pop up where it says um, 
continue shopping, which was annoying the hell out of me. You'd have to click it to continue shopping, which I think was really, really stupid to do. They obviously took that away as nothing did pop up. And right here we have open and uninstall at the top now, and we just click one of those and open it up. So guys, I am, you should really go try this out. It looks awesome. We have a lot of cool stuff here. Still get most of the basic stuff, but in a completely new layout. So guys, um, really go download and try it out. Um, as I said, I'll have the download link below. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to comment, like, subscribe. Also, donate to me um, to make so I could get future devices to review. And the Galaxy S4 is coming soon. So guys, if you're getting that device, also make sure to subscribe as I will be having a lot of re reviews with that. Okay, guys. Peace.